we have set out five clear tests as to what's uh, incredibly important and what will inform the opening of the, uh, of the schools. Uh, we want to make sure that schools are given proper notice, but we do not have a date as to when schools are going to be opening. Do you imagine when they do open, it will be in stages? And, and would you favour primary opening first or secondary schools opening first? Uh, I do expect schools to be opened in a phased manner. Uh, I also intend to be giving schools as much notices as possible in order to be able to ensure... And, and, uh, and should they open in the... Should they open in the summer holidays? We're not planning uh, to uh, run schools through the summer. Uh, but as I was talking about earlier, what we are doing is we're looking at a whole set of interventions to help children both catch up in terms of uh, their work across the whole broad setting of uh, children of, uh, uh, of all backgrounds. But we're also looking at different interventions that we can make uh, in order to be able to help children from the most disadvantaged backgrounds. Most homes, 95%, have a TV uh, station. Have you had any thoughts about perhaps working with the BBC or other broadcasting services to provide a, a long-term national education service on television that would broadcast a few hours a day and people could access through a red bus and what year uh, they were in? This is something that we have been working very closely with the BBC on, and I've um, had a number of meetings with uh, Director General of the BBC, Tony, uh, Lord Hall, uh, in order to discuss this uh, exact issue and if I can take the opportunity to thank the BBC for launching the largest ever uh, education programme that they've had in the corporation's history, uh, recognising the point that people want, don't always have a, a, a laptop or um, a, a sort of some form of a, um, sort of a tablet in their home and recognising a TV is a great way of doing that. We've been working closely with the BBC They've got an extensive programme. We are always very keen to see how we could uh, make that a, a more extensive programme. What's the likely time frame of the rollout of the laptop and the accompanying data, which is proving even more important for many families? Uh, in terms of time frame, uh, this week we'll be writing to uh, all local authorities and Morty Academy Trust to give them a clear uh, uh, indication as to what the allocations that they'll be receiving in terms of uh, this rollout to digital equipment and uh, we expect the, the first laptops to be uh, arriving uh, at the end of May with the majority delivered uh, through June. We do not see this rollout to digital equipment to be something that is just to deal with uh, the, the challenge that we're facing today. Uh, we see this as part of addressing the longer term problem in terms of actually helping children uh, get what they need in terms of their learning as rapidly as possible over the summer period and uh, going into the next academic year as well.